Hello students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting video, I would like to tell you something. Please sit with copy pen. If you find somewhere important, pause the video, note it and proceed on. If you find somewhere difficulty, then please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel. That can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. Now here is the question. <clears throat> Two identical conducting rods are first connected independently in two vessels, one containing water at 100 degrees Celsius and the other containing ice at 0 degrees Celsius. In the second case, the rod are joined end to end and connected to the same vessel, let Q1 and Q2 gram per seconds be the rate of melting of ice in the two cases respectively. The rate Q1 is to Q2 is here we have given four options option A 1 by 2, option B 2 by 1, option C 4 by 1, option D 1 by 4. And this question is asked J 2004 mains. Now, according to this question, we have given two containers one container filled with water at uh, 100 degrees Celsius, right? And second container filled with ice. Okay. And here, these two vessels connected with rod such in a way that is the parallel. Okay. When the connecting rods connected parallel, then we can see that here the contact area become double and length is same. Okay. And second case, in second case, here again same vessel, same temperature 100 degree Celsius. This is ice at uh, 0 degree Celsius and this rod is connected in series. Okay. So here, Area is the same, but distance is become double. So here, the amount of heat which is a flow from higher to lower that is considered here first case Q1 and here Q2. Okay. So as we know that the formula we have using Q by T flow of heat is equal to K A theta 1 minus theta 2 upon D. This formula we are using to solve this question. Okay. In first case, in first case, Q by T, this is first case, let us say Q1. Okay. Here K, same rod, identical rod. So, we have using K. Here area of the contact of higher body that is double A, A to A. So, we have put here 2 A. Higher temperature is 100, lower temperature is 0 and upon D. Okay. And for the second case, we can see that Q by T, let us say this is second case and Q2, okay, is it equal to here K is the same area of cross section A, temperature 100 minus 0 and distance, here distance we have taken 2D, okay, it is the second case, it is first case and we have to calculate Q1 upon Q2. So here, now, Q1 upon Q2, 2KA, 100 minus 0 means 100 upon D and upon here KA, 100 and this upon up upon which is in numerator then 2D. This KA, KA cancel, 100, 100 cancel, D, D cancel, then Q1 upon Q2 is equal to 2 to the 4, 4 is to 1. Okay. So, this is the answer. I hope so. You understood this question. Thank you for staying till the end of this video. Definitely, when you will become success, whole contribution goes to your hard work. But if my videos, my lectures, my questions will help in your success, I will consider myself lucky. Please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. Take care. Bye-bye.